All right. <clears throat> so this video is going to be like multiple parts because it's pretty long and I'm going to make them probably like 10 minutes each and it'll probably be like five videos or maybe even six. And I know nobody wants to sit through an hour of me explaining how to make extra money because I don't want to sit through an hour of me explaining how to make extra money. So the first one I'm going to start with is going to be car related and I'll start simple. So one of the main ones I do is related to wheels. So here's what you can do. And actually, before I actually start getting into the thing, a lot of people are younger and a lot of people are in a position like me where or a similar position to me where they're either younger or they're slightly older not like older like in their 50s or whatever but they're like slightly older like in their 20s or whatever and they don't have like an extremely high amount of disposable income or they don't have their parents who are like giving them money to like build their car or to support their um hobbies and habits and whatnot so it's like they need to make extra money so one thing that i do which is car related has to do with um wheels so with wheels you can do this with cheap wheels expensive wheels whatever so let's start cheap so one thing that i do is this you go on craigslist and you search up uh let's say 5x114 which is really popular so you look up 5x114 and you can find um something that is um relatively similar to a lot of cars which could be um like infinity wheels or um what do you call it or nissan 350z stock wheels or anything like that which are like 17s and 18 so 17 by seven and a half 17 by eight 18 by eight and within like 25 and like 35 offset so you find wheels like that that are in pretty good condition or in very good condition for a decent price with good tires. And then what you do is, let's say you buy a set of four wheels. So one thing I did was this. When I bought the 350Z, I didn't buy the 350Z with the wheels that it came on, as some of you guys remember. Um, it came, it had the CCWs. What I did was I looked around and I found a set of Nissan 350Z wheels for $50 with brand new tires. So what I did was I bought those and, um, I put those on the car and then I drove it around for a little while. And then I, um, took those wheels off and I sold those wheels for, 350 so not only did i make a 300 dollars profit but i bought another set of wheels the um motegi two gay wheels motegi twoge two gay whatever wheels for 200 dollars. so that means um after everything i spent 150 dollars i mean i made 150 dollars so I put wheels on the car that were wider and bigger and they looked better and I made $150. So that $150 could go to whatever, insurance, another part, money to do something else, whatever, gas, anything that's extra money. Another thing you can do is just buying a set of wheels to flip. Like this can be done with anything, which I'll be getting into later parts of this video, but it's just like. Things like that can be done with anything. And then another thing with wheels is like how I bought the set of wheels for $50 and it came with brand new tires. I could have made even more money if I took the wheels off of the tires. I could have sold the wheels themselves for $250 and I could have sold the tires for $200 to $250 for the set of tires because the tires were literally brand new. Like it still had the little like pokey things on it i don't know what those are called but they were literally brand new the tires had like 15 miles on them i believe like the guy he drove them from the tire shop 
to his house and he took the wheels off the thing. Like, literally, they were brand new. Like, they were brand new tires. So, I could have made $450 off of them. But, like, things like that. <clears throat> Granted, that's a really high amount of profit. But, you can do things like that a lot. So, it's like, you can buy wheels like, um, I bought more expensive wheels. Like, I bought, like... BBS wheels, like the bought um, some style fives. I bought many sets of style fives. I'm pretty sure I've had like ten sets of style fives in good condition. I've had bad condition. I've had many videos of me going to get style fives, and I've had videos of me cleaning style fives and um, getting the tires off. And I've sold the tires and I've sold the wheels separately, and I've done stuff like that a lot on the ch on this channel because that's just something I do. Because for the most part. I don't work. I used to do um, delivery for favor, which is pretty, which is, um, I believe they're in Texas only now. And that's like you, it's basically Uber Eats. But back then when I was doing it, it was like the only company that you could work with that was paying you the same day. So you work however long you want, an hour, two hours, three hours, four hours, whatever. And then when you clock out, you can you um can just deposit it to your bank account right away, which is one thing I like. Like I hate waiting for the end of the week to get the paycheck and whatever. Like that's that's annoying. But yeah, that's also another way to make money. But I'll be explaining that in another later video as well. But it's just like with wheels, there are so many ways because there are so many things you can do with wheels. You can buy wheels and refinish them. You can just flip them. You can um put bigger tires, smaller tires, winter tires, all season tires. You can rebuild wheels, which I'll be getting into as well because I'm probably going to be doing that. You can do wheel wholesale. You can ship wheels internationally. Like this wheels is a very, very big business and it's a very big growing business. And there's so much that you can do with wheels that it's something that I've really been considering, and later on in the progression of the channel, you guys may see me doing more with wheels. I'm in talks with a few people and a few different local companies and a few different local people who do things with wheels, and if it all goes according to plan or if our talks amount to anything like solid, then things will actually you know, things will actually occur either as a group effort or I'll do them on my own. However, it'll be, if it's on my own, it'll start as a smaller scale, but as a group, it'll be something bigger collaboratively. You know how it goes, like with group work, things start off bigger. But anyhow, like wheels is something that I've used to help me get a lot of car parts. Like even a few minutes ago, I was online looking for, just looking up wheels and just seeing what was on there because it's like, you never know, maybe you'll find a set of, like, BBS wheels for a hunt. Somebody may have a car that has um, BBS wheels on it. And what I've done before is I'll see somebody selling a car, like, um, a 740i M Sport, and they'll be selling the car for, like, $500. Granted, I don't have an auction license or anything, but the person may be selling the car, and I may, be know, I may know somebody who has a set of wheels for, like, a hundred bucks and the beep then the bbs wheels are worth like five hundred dollars or more so what i can do is buy the wheels for a hundred dollars and tell the person um or i'll set this up beforehand tell the person um i'll give you these wheels plus a hundred dollars for the wheels that are on your car because those wheels will fit my car and these wheels will fit yours and they'll be like, okay, whatever, blah, blah, blah. And then you'll switch the wheels and then you'll sell the BBS wheels or whichever wheels are on the car. That's just an example for money. And that's how you put a couple extra dollars in your pocket. And me personally, a lot of people are going to be like, oh, why would you be telling people all these things that you do to make money? It's like, for me, at the end of the day, a lot of people, for one, don't live around me. And for two, I really don't mind helping other people make money because, like, that's just... That's the way of the world. This, this nothing that I'm doing is new. I'm not doing anything new. People have been doing what I'm doing right now for a very since. That's just it. Like people go to junkyards and do what I'm doing. People are online doing what I'm doing every day. As I'm making this video right now, people are getting the deals that I'm missing, and that's just that's life. 
Yeah, the end of the video got cut off, but I was going to say, but as I was saying, a lot of people are asking why I would be telling people what I do to make money. And one, it's because a lot of people request it. Two, it's because nothing I'm doing is new. Three, it's because I don't mind helping people. Like, somebody help me. I'm not selfish. I'm not doing anything new. Nothing I'm doing is illegal. It's like, why not help somebody out? And that's just it. Why not? There's enough to go around. There's trillions of dollars to be made, hundreds and thousands of things to be bought and sold. Like, yeah, there's just no need to be selfish. So at the end of the day, I'm never mad about helping somebody and I'm not going to be selfish about it. So, yeah. Um. Anyhow, there's a lot to come. This is just the first part of the video. There's so much more that I can talk about and I can ramble on this topic for like, I could probably do like a hundred hour podcast on this so if you want to see more comment you know just ask anything you want to ask and i'll make sure that i answer a question specifically in the coming videos but i literally have like pages in my phone of things to answer and topics to go over on just the subject of how i make money and how to make extra money so slap that like button, comment, subscribe, share this with your friends, you know, tell people what I'm telling you, like, even if they, you don't have them watch a video, you know, there's always friends who want to make money, there's always friends you want to work with, your friends may have ideas, put some money together, buy something, split the profit, whatever, like, there's enough money for everybody to go around, there's enough stuff to buy, like, if I had somebody to work with and do all these things with, I definitely would do it, but people just don't work on the same time frame as you, so maybe one day I will, maybe one day I won't, but who knows. Anyhow, thanks for watching. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe if you want. If you don't want to, it's fine with me as well, but anyhow, stay tuned for the next one. There's a lot coming, so yeah.